what's up guys, it's your boy, it's Pilot 2K7 and I'm back for a brand new Grand Theft Auto 5 real life mod video. Today I'm coming back to you guys with the UPS mod. As you can see, we now have a brand new UPS distribution center behind me and we're going to be delivering from the distribution center here to another location out in uh, Polito Bay. So we're going to actually be a feeder driver today, so we're not going to be driving the uh, standard brown delivery trucks we're actually going to be driving one of these peterbilt semi trucks today single axle trucks so let's go ahead and hop in alrighty so I had my truck sit in warming up and we are now ready to go so let's go ahead and take a look at the new distribution center this has been modded into the game it's pretty cool i will link all of the mods that i'm using today down below in the video description as well in case you guys are interested in checking them out all right so first thing we're going to do is actually connect to this trailer right here I see from the inside actually I never checked up I uh, can't look back on the interior oh, I could I could look like this so we kind of see the uh, kingpin up oh, oh. okay I think we got it all right let's hop out and make sure we are connected and it looks like are we connected yeah, it looks like we're connected. It looks a little off, but it's good. So we're going to be hauling this trailer today, guys, but we're actually going to be hauling three of them. We're going to be hauling triples today for the first time, so that should be a ton of fun. I did do this before, but last time we did it, we was hauling uh, double trailers, and we picked it up from a different location over here. So this time, we're at the distribution center, and we're taking it from here all the way up to Polito Bay, which is going to be right about here. So it's going to be a pretty long drive. Uh, last time, like I said, we we started over here and it actually made us go this way. So today's route is going to be a little bit different. If you guys want to check out the last video we did when we hauled the doubles, I'll link it down below in the video description as well as in the top right. So as you can see, all of the guys over here are getting ready to go out on their routes. They're loading up the trucks. Yep, loading up all the boxes on the truck. So these are going to be all the local deliveries. And then we're taking the feeder deliveries all the way up to Polito Bay. Where uh, then it will be unloaded and placed on smaller trucks to be delivered. So now what we have to do is actually uh, use some of these dollies over here. So we can go ahead and get everything connected. So let's run back to our truck. Of my deliveries last week. <laughs> he only lost 15% of his deliveries? Wow, that's a lot. Alright, so as you, here you can see all the different trailers. The one that we're going to connect to is actually already ready to go. It's currently assembled as a double, and once we back this piece up to it, it will be a triple. Oh, you know what? I forgot. I actually have to get out and get back in for it to connect. Alright, I forgot it's not going to automatically connect so I'll get in and then uh, it should be able to connect here. There we go, now it's connected. Alright, so we now have all of the trailers connected now. Obviously, Grand Theft Auto 5 was not made for us to do any of this stuff, so it's going to get a little bit crazy. You can kind of see the trucks or the trailer is kind of bouncing around right now. So I'm going to warn you guys, it's going to get extremely bouncy while we're on the road and probably even worse once we get onto the highway. But we're going to try to just do our best here today. So if you guys do enjoy this episode, you want to see more cool things like this, make sure you guys go ahead and smash that like button. Leave some comments down below and subscribe if you are new so we have eight miles to go it's gonna be a long journey here okay let's just try to take it nice and easy Oh, 
Oh man, look at that. See, the first one is pretty stable. The second one is a little bit rocky, but the third one is just all over the place. I wonder if there's anything I could do to make it a little bit more stable. Maybe it's maybe it's like too light or something. So maybe if we make it heavier, it would uh, not bounce around as much. I don't know. Oh shit, I thought this was a one way for a second. I know normally, I think most of uh, UPS uh, semi trucks are actually Kenworths, but I know a lot of them are like single axle trucks, like this single rear axle, so. I decided to use this Peterbilt since it was single rear axle, even though they don't really seem to use Peterbilt stuff. I know they do have some um, dual rail rear axles as well, so we could also try to use the semi truck, but they don't really use trucks with sleepers, so that's why I just figured we'll use this day cab. Four feet eleven inches. That doesn't seem correct. Cause this truck is probably or the trailer is probably thirteen feet. So yeah, that that doesn't seem too accurate. All right, so I'm gonna try to follow the rules today. I know I don't normally follow the rules because sometimes these lights take forever, but I'm gonna try to today. And we'll see how far we can make it. Once I get on the highway, I should be okay. But I know the city, the city lights. The wait, how did that guy just? Did he get hit? I don't even know. But yeah, once we get onto the highway, we should be okay. It's just the city part is annoying. Gotta make sure we uh, take these turns wide enough as well. Now, normally you would even drive a triple trailer through a city like this but we got to do what we got to do to swing this one around. That was not my fault. They, she, he's dead. Oh my goodness. They literally did that themselves. They walked into it. Ooh. Oh my god, I just killed two people here. Oh man. This is off to a bad start. We're about to get fired, guys. I was trying not to hit that pole. Ended up hitting a person. But, uh, yeah, we're just gonna act like that didn't just happen. Alright, let's see if we could get through this delivery without hitting anybody else. Come 
Come on, don't, don't move. See, those don't count because AI just doesn't see the trail right there, so I can't avoid those. Just like how the first guy walked into me, I just can't avoid that. At least sing though, if they're gonna cut me off like that. I was gonna say this guy's about to walk right into my trailer. Be lucky the light changed. We're about halfway done with our city driving at least. Uh, we should be able to jump on the uh, highway in about another mile or so. What is he doing? He literally got over just to get right back over. Why does he wait the same guy? He waits for me to go and then he tries to cross in front of me. Ay, ay, ay.
Alright guys, so three miles down, five miles to go, and it should be much easier now since we're actually going to be getting onto the highway. I'm actually surprised it's not too out of control. I guess on the turns, yeah. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Three miles to go. Alright, coming up on two miles. We are nearly there, guys. We are nearly there.
That flat that up front is going so slow. It's holding up traffic right now. We gotta get in front of this guy. Dang, I wanna get in front of him. I think it turns into a two way anyway. Oh, shoot! My bad. That was my fault. Let's stand them out to go. Just got to get around these slow moving trucks. And that thing looks like it's about to flip over. All right guys, so we are here. This is another modded in location. You guys are gonna see the UPS sign here in a moment. And there it is, as you can see, UPS uh, Blaine County Depot. So we're gonna have to uh, load these in, but I think I'm gonna have to back them in one by one because it's gonna be impossible for me to back them in as triple. So, Let's go ahead and get everything disconnected and I'll try to back them in one by one. Alright, so I have all of the uh, different trailers disconnected now. We're going to go ahead and park it up. I always forget that happens when I disconnect with this truck. Don't mind that. <laughs> All right, let's get the next one. So that's one.
all right guys so i think we got all three of them in uh, all of this stuff is going to get unloaded out of these trailers they'll be taken inside and then they'll be sorted so they could be placed onto the smaller trucks for local delivery here out of blaine county depot so hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode again if you enjoyed the episode today please go ahead and smash that like button leave some comments down below if you're new around here make sure you subscribe turn on post notifications we have new videos dropping every single day we're gonna be doing fun things so make sure you guys come back and um check out all the new videos so thank you guys for watching really do hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys in the next one peace